I search for love, it's nowhere to be found. Hey, it told me that love is purified. But why is mine so ugly? Every day I'm drowning in the boom of my tears. Is there a different love? Or is it a crime to fall in love? These questions I keep on asking. She was right. That wasn't the right time for me to witness such a happy occasion. And I really hated myself for not being there for my friend on one of her happiest days. I mean, it's only a sadist who would be that angry at something good happening to her friend. And I hated that I was becoming that person. So when they set their wedding preparation in motion, and I was given the maid of honor role, I threw myself right in, refusing to have a minute to brood about my not so perfect life. And so I did with work. And yeah, I did get that promotion, but I couldn't even be genuinely happy for myself, for my hard work, my diligence. Instead, I felt so empty inside until that night, the night I supposedly noticed him. I search for love, it's nowhere to be found. Hey, it told me that love is purified. But why is mine so ugly? Every day I'm drowning in the boom of my tears. Is there a different love? Or is it a crime to fall in love? These questions I keep on asking And yet I got no answer So tears has been my fault And alcohol is my company Even when I cry, even when I drink The pain can go away That's why I'm asking Why me oh It's love again me, or do I just have a new lock? Hey, I so I'm asking why? Why am I always crying? I don't believe in love anymore. Cause love is so wicked to me. Is blended. I search for love, it's nowhere to be found. Hey, they told me that love is purified. But why is mine so ugly? Every day I'm drowning in the boom of my tears. Is there a different love, or is it a crime to fall in love? These questions I keep on asking And yet I got no answer So tears has been my fault And alcohol is my company Even when I cry, even when I drink The pain can go away That's why I'm asking Is love against me, or do I just have a new luck? Hey, I so I'm asking why, why am I always crying? I don't believe in love anymore, cause love is so wicked to me. I 
I search for love, it's nowhere to be found. Hey, they told me that love is purified. But why is mine so ugly? Every day I'm drowning in the pool of my tears. Is there a different love? Or is it a crime to fall in love? These questions I keep on asking And yet I got no answer So tears has been my fault And alcohol is my company Even when I cry, even when I drink The pain can go away That's why I'm asking Why me oh Is love again? Me, or do I just have a meal like oh, hey, I So I'm asking why Why am I always crying I don't believe in love anymore Cause love is so wicked to me Broken my heart is deep in a blender Hey, my heart is blended I search for love, it's nowhere to be found Hey, they told me that love is purified But why is mine so ugly? Every day I'm drowning in the pool of my tears Is there a different love? Or is it a crime to fall in love? These questions I keep on asking And yet I got no answer I search for love, it's nowhere to be found Hey, they told me that love is purified But why is mine so ugly? Every day I'm drowning in the pool of my tears Is there a different love? Or is it a crime to fall in love? These questions I keep on asking And yet I got no answer So tears has been my fault And alcohol is my company Even when I cry, even when I dream no pain can go away That's why I'm asking Why me oh Is love against me Or do I just have a meal like oh Yeah, so I'm asking why Why am I always crying I don't believe in love anymore Cause love is so wicked to me and me I was broken my heart is deep in a blender hey my heart is blended I search for love it's nowhere to be found hey Told me that love is purified But why is mine so ugly? Every day I'm drowning in the pool of my tears Is there a different love? Or is it a crime to fall in love? These questions I keep on asking And yet I got no answer So tears has been my fault and alcohol is my company Even when I cry, even when I drink The pain can go away That's why I'm asking Why me oh Is love against me? Or do I just have a meal like oh AI? So I'm asking why Why am I always crying? I don't believe in love anymore 
Cause love is so ghetto to me long and you're already in the kitchen cooking up a storm aren't you as usual <laughs> <laughs> well it's a good thing to have you back girlfriend thank you you know i miss your food i know turn around because oh you're God. glowing oh, mrs goodness. richie to be mm? not now v what go upstairs get showered mm -hmm. change mm -hmm. and dinner will be set in time yes i can't wait <laughs> Turn around, turn around. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you. Oh, God. Thank you. <laughs> I swear, V. It's like... I was a princess in my former life or something. Because, I mean, I literally did nothing. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, I can understand why it's like that. I mean, this family have no history of having female children. Mm. And with you about to be married as daughter-in-law, mm -hmm. surely everyone will automatically take you to be their sister. <laughs> and that should make you happy. Did you say happy? Mm -hmm. Babes, that's an understatement. I am thrilled. I know. <laughs> you know, I've listened to conversations about girls discussing about their will be mm -hmm. in laws and mm -hmm. all that. Oh, yeah. <sighs> Some even wish for their mother in law to be late. Exactly. You're right. Yeah. I am an exception. Totally, totally an exception. Mm -hmm. God, whatever will happen to my mother-in-law should happen to me first. R what? <laughs> Did I really hear you say that? Yes, girl, you don't understand. This woman is so good. Her wow. husband is not an exception either. Mm -hmm. Well, you make it sound like you've had it easy since you've been dating that guy. I recall you've had your fair share of fights. One time, he had this crazy psychopathic girlfriend that wanted to pour acid on you. Don't she and her friends. Don't remember that? Don't Girl, remember. Girl, that was don't. an error. <laughs> Listen, what you're enjoying now mm -hmm. is the benefits of all the battles you fought and won. So, girl, enjoy it. Thumbs up to me. Mm hmm. <laughs> But not to worry, girlfriend. Mm -hmm. Your time is coming, okay? You're going to meet your Mr. Right, and it will end in praise. Well, well, well. That's <laughs> if I haven't met him already. You're kidding. What? <gasps> oh my goodness, girl, shut the front door! How? Since when? Babes. When were you planning on introducing him to me? Girl, that's not fair! This is why. The way you bombarded me with questions. That's why. Eat your food. No, no, no. Don't even give me that. No! No, I remember how you literally drilled the information for me when Richie and I got together. It's your turn. Girl, speak. <laughs> Every detail. You're gonna choke on your food. <laughs> Girl! Okay, I'll make you a promise. What? We finish eating. Uh huh. Move over to the Palo area. Uh -huh. Then I could tell you about him. I might even show you what he looks like. For real? Mm -hmm. You promise? You heard me. I'm eating already. <laughs> you. Mm -hmm. you. Can't wait to see. Him. You're so predictable. <laughs> <laughs> what? 
Cheers, girl. Cheers, girl. To find in love. Yes. And to stay in love. Yaha. <laughs> We were done eating. Keep to your word. I need to see it, guys. <laughs> show me, show me. Are you sure you're ready? I am. <laughs> okay. Okay, okay. I mean, <laughs> I'm so excited. There it is. <laughs> oh, my goodness. He's handsome. I know, right? This guy is a block. Tell me about <laughs> it. Yo, I can literally perceive his charisma oozing from him. From the phone? Girl, <laughs> please, give me that phone. You know I'm right. No, you're exaggerating right now. No, I'm not. <laughs> oh my goodness, girl. No wonder you've changed. I have? Yeah, you literally gained some weight. Stop it. No. Stop playing with me. Girl, have you looked at yourself in the mirror recently? What am I even saying? You know, you always need to look at yourself in the mirror because you need to look good for your Prince Charming. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I know that's right. And wow. that's what I'm doing. I know. So, mm. what? So, girl, you guys haven't met. Not yet. Why? I mean, he seemed like a pretty decent person. Oh, he is. He's good. So why? What does he do? He is a mechanical engineer. Okay. He lives in Port Harcourt. Mm -hmm. And guess what? What? We are meeting this weekend. Really? Yeah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> he has a business trip to make down mm -hmm. here and... We figure it's a great opportunity for us to meet, right? Plus, he is planning on relocating. That's mm. if he gets the promotion he's hoping on. Oh, I hope Fingers so crossed. too. Yes. Fingers crossed. I hope so too, girl. <laughs> yeah. I mean, that would be so great. I know. Yeah, being closer to each other mm -hmm. will make your relationship mm -hmm. easy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Tell me I'm about happy it. happy for you. Thank you very much. Now, girl, I'm giving you one month max. To do what? After seeing him one on one, mm -hmm. to introduce him to me. Else, girl, I'm gonna be stalking him on all social media <laughs> platforms. Oh, you wouldn't dare. <laughs> Try me. Girl, you're not crazy. <laughs> That's what crazy bitches do. <laughs> you're not that girl. <laughs> oh my God. But yeah, I'll introduce you too. It's not I'm a problem. I'm so happy for you. Thank you very much. Oh, yeah. You were so sweet. <laughs> Wow, who could have thought that my own friend yeah. who hates all this social yeah, media, I know, long I know, I distance know. relationship, mm -hmm. will be going on for like how long? Four <laughs> months? <laughs> Girl. Four whole months. Tell me about it. <laughs> how you beat my imagination this time? Well, I aim to please. <laughs> <laughs> What's his name again? Derek. Derek. Did you hear how I mentioned it? Yeah. Derek. <laughs> With the D. <laughs> Girl, leave me alone. I'm happy for you. Thank you very much. Oh, you're so sweet. <laughs> hey, my heart is blended. I search for love. There's nowhere to be found. Hey, you told me that love is purified. But why is my so ugly? Every day I'm drowning in the boom of my tears Is there a different love? Or is it a crime to fall in love? These questions I keep on asking And yet I got no answer So this has been my... Wow, look who we have here Venice, aha! You know, uh... I'm sorry about that. 
And like I was saying, I, our destiny must be so aligned. You know, I was thinking of paying you a visit anytime soon, and here you are. I you don't take your calls or even reply my test. All right, I it didn't go through. It seems like you blocked me. What are you doing? I'm trying to hold a conversation with my girl. Yes. It's been a while, but you still look very beautiful. So beautiful as always. I can't wait to see you, you know what I'm talking about. You must be stupid to have thought that I'll pick your call after the last time. Does your, does your girlfriend know you're talking to your ex? Wait, let me rephrase that. Does she know she's your newest toy? Then it's you. You always break my heart with your with your words. Why? Was it because of that little mishap that happened in my place all the time? If you had picked my call, I would have explained to you what happened. What happened exactly? It's not what you're thinking, trust me. Why? I miss you. Didn't you miss me? Are you mad? And it's, I, this is actually a public place and I don't think we need to pick up a fight here. It's pretty. I believe the young lady has made her stand near to you. And you are? You're a gentleman, you should respect that. You're in my seat, get lost. And you are? I am the man who's going to put a ring on your finger. The man who's going to make sure that scumbags like yourself don't come anywhere close to our day. Most importantly, the man who's going to make sure she's extremely happy. Now, does that answer your question? I'm not kidding. It's kidding, right? Tell me it's kidding. Yeah. I said get lost. Hey, man, take it easy. I said get lost and let a single girl breathe. What kind of rubbish is this? You need to calm down when the public place it. They're looking at us. Come on. You don't have to feel sorry for something you didn't do. It's not your fault. Why are you putting your head down? Why the humiliation? You're shouting when the public people are looking at us. Relax, it's fine. I'm very embarrassed by what happened earlier. You must even what? You have an ex? Or exes? I mean, some crazy ex? Come on. I didn't come down here hoping to come into a naive virgin. I knew you had a past. And so do I. That doesn't make us bad people or ineligible to find love, does it? You're not ashamed of yourself. You're a fool. Hey, hey, hey baby, you need to understand. How dare you? How dare you touch me? I'm saying, there's this new line she a friend of mine told me about. I said I was going to try it whenever I come to town. I was going to take us there after eating here. Been, but I haven't witnessed what happened there and how this guy ruined your mood. I think that would be the best place to go now to at least help lift your mood. So please let's go. I search for love, there's nowhere to be found. Hey, they told me that love is purified. But why is mine so ugly? Every day I'm drowning in the pool of my tears. Is there a different love, or is it a crime to fall in love? These questions I keep on asking, and yet I got no answer. Thank you. You're Beautiful welcome. Place you have here. Thanks. <laughs> I had such a great time. It's really amazing how you don't reside in this city, yet you know a lot of places. Um, I know, right? 
I mean, like I said before, I got to know about this place through my friend who is a food and nature lover. I mean, he updates me with every new spot in town. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Nice. And I am still feeling bad for, you know, the incident with the guy. I, I didn't mean for that to happen. I never envisaged that we'd meet under such awkward situation. <sighs> Crazy. Um, is that why you, you wouldn't meet my eyes? <laughs> well, kind of. I meant what I said. We all have baggage. We've hurt others and we've been hurt. It's just the reality of life. I like you just the way you are, V. No addition, no subtraction. Just you. <laughs> Sit down. Let me make you coffee. Oh, well, okay. I make Beautiful. the best coffee. Really? Yeah. I, I can't wait to try it. <laughs> Blender. Hey, my heart is blended. I search for love, there's nowhere to be found. Hey, they told me that love is purified. But why is mine so ugly? Every day I'm drowning in the pool of my tears. Is there a different love? That was how we kicked off. Derek did get that promotion. He moved into the big city. Divine and Rishi got married. Two years down the line, everything was sailing smoothly. Until. Until what happened? Listen, you don't have to tell me if you do not want to. I totally get it. All right? I miss the signs. The midnight calls. The hushed phone conversations. The constant business trips, even the office late night calls, I should have seen them. I should have embraced the truth when divine came revealing them. I'm sorry, what did you just say? V, please calm down. Wait a minute, you just told me a whole lot of cock and bull story about my man. And you want me to calm down? How? See? This is exactly why I didn't want to tell you in the first place. Because I knew you were going to take it this way. Huh. But what am I supposed to do? Sit and watch my friend get burned? Believe me, Derek is not one you think he is. Shut up and get out. Right this minute, girl, you heard me. Excuse me? Mm -hmm. Be gone and never you come back here. <sighs> v, please, I just want you to be careful, okay? I don't want you to be at the crossroads, hurt and abandoned again. Okay. Well, it's nice to know your wishes for me, but I'll have you know that I'll never, ever be at a crossroad. And even if I eventually find myself at a crossroad, I would never come to you. You understand? Now get to stepping. <laughs> Move it, girl. Move. Whatever. Suit yourself. Mm -hmm. Don't come running back to me. Oh. What? 
These questions I keep on asking And yet I got no answer So this has been my fault And alcohol is my company Even when I cry, even when I drink No pain can go away That's why I'm asking Why me is love against me, or do I just have a new luck? Oh, yeah, so I'm asking why. Why am I always crying? I don't believe in love anymore. Babe, what's wrong? What is it? You know, I was I was worried when you called out of the blue to cancel your sleepover. What is it? Baby, talk to me. What is it? Is it work? What's wrong? Derek. Kiss me. <laughs> Wait, oh, why? Come on, talk to me. What is it? What's wrong? Kiss me now. That's why I'm asking. Why me? Oh, is love against me? Or do I just have a new luck? Oh, yeah, it's so I'm asking why. Why am I always crying? I don't believe in love. Olivia, I can't believe you, V. I mean, you're choosing your friend's words over mine? God! Baby, it's not like that. Divine was worried and... And she lied to you. And you stupidly believed her. Huh? Wait. Was that why? Why what? Why you cancelled? I mean, you were supposed to sleep over at my place tonight. But then you called out of the blue to cancel. Was that why? I can't believe you. Two years, V. Two years into our relationship. And now you're doubting. You choose now to doubt my sincerity? It's not that way. I mean, it's not like I believed her. If I did, I wouldn't have asked you. I wouldn't have told you, don't you think? Who knows? Who knows if you just want to hear it from me? You want to hear even that I am cheating on you? Isn't that it? Who knows how much more she fed you with? Who knows how much more you're harboring your heart about me? I'm not good out for all of this. Now I'm in love. I thought this would last forever. But I am so wrong. Cause you just blame me I thought this will last forever And who does that? So, um, you went ahead and told him I was distraught, okay? Derek and I never hid anything from each other Come on but not to the point of writing your friend out to him. That would create a bad impression, don't you think so? It did. And that ruined our friendship. I mean, Derek went and confronted Divine, and Divine, being Divine, didn't refute the claims. It ruined our friendship. She stopped talking to me. She stopped coming to my house. We stopped hanging out on Saturdays, on weekends like we usually did. She stopped inviting me to her house for dinner on weekends. I mean, even when her parents-in-law had their wedding anniversary, Richie invited me. Divine saw me there and pretended like she barely knew me. She was pretty hot that I didn't see the truth that she was making me see. OK, 
Okay, then you found out um, he was cheating on you, yeah? Technically, he wasn't cheating on his wife. I'm the one that he was cheating on her way. It turns out, he has a wife. Or should I say, a fiance, whom he's been with for over eight years. Hold on a minute. You mean wifey or fiancé? Because I don't get it. <laughs> hey, babe. Yes? Of course, I'm getting ready. Are you here yet? Wow. Well, hurry up. I'll be here waiting for you. Okay. Derek? Is that you playing friends again? I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming! Yes? Oh, hello. Hi. Who, who are you? So. This is the hole he's been hiding you. I'm sorry, who are you? What an amazing place you have here. So this is the hole he's been hiding you? What? I don't know you and we don't know each other. Why are you here in my house? Did you miss your way or something? What do you want? Am I? Really? Let me think. What do you make of a woman who's been busy screwing another woman's husband? From the information I got, you seem to be a really decent lady. But, aren't you ashamed of yourself to stoop so low to be a side chick? Excuse you? What are you talking about? What? You want to say more? <laughs> Drake, the man you have been scrolling for the past two years is actually my husband. What? <laughs> Please, don't pretend as if you don't know. You are not his first side chick. You certainly won't be the last. Ask his other side chick that will tell you that he's a cheat and a liar. So please, as a smart lady that you are, I believe you know what to do. I thought this would last forever But I am so wrong Cause you just playing games hey. I can believe that I'm a fool again I thought this love will never rain But now I know I can't believe that Once again I'm crying 
for me. You're not even dressed. Big boss should go in here. Are you being serious right now? Like really, really serious. Oh my god. Man, you've got nerves coming in here, Mr. Derek. Of course I have to be here to pick up my girl for an event we both need to attend. What did you do to get a mood for it like this? Excuse you. What I did to... You're sick. The actual question should be, what did you do? What else? You know, when you stomped my office about a year ago, I thought to myself, maybe I was wrong. Yeah. Maybe I judged you harshly. Maybe the information I got was wrong. Maybe I needed to cross-check facts rather than jumping into conclusion. But guess what? I was right the whole time. You are a scumbag! A cheat and a bloody liar! Excuse you the hell out! Exactly! You were excused to go to hell and burn! Now get out of here! Get out and stay out! I don't know what it is they've told you, but you need to tell me and, I mean, give me a chance to defend myself. You mean I should give you some space to tell me more lies and give me false hope? You want me to give you more opportunity to ridicule me, Derek? To ridicule me more than you already did? Is that what you want? Baby, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know what, is the, or what it is they fed you with, but you don't have to believe them. They are all lies. Babe, there are a lot of persons who don't want to see you and I together. Don't you see it? Well, what I see is a lying man standing before me, lying. Lying about his life, about his family. Do you think I fell out with my friend because of you? When all she did was stand by me. You need to go. Come on, baby. You don't have to do... Please, talk to me, baby. Please. Uh oh, no, 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 no. Leave. Right now. Leave. What did you tell her again? Here he goes again. I didn't need to tell her anything. Have you forgotten? We stopped talking after that fiasco the last time? Huh? Why don't you go and ask your wife what she told her? Yes. Go do that. My wife, what are you talking about? I am not married. Really? I know. Lots of you ain't married. That's some stale news. Please, she's not in the mood right now, okay? She's not stable. You can come back when she's ready to listen to you. You can go. Go. Babe. I said leave. Did you say my wife? No. 
I meant your husband. Okay, get out. Get out. Go and handle the mother of your kids. Get out. Get out. Get out. Babe. Go and handle the mother of your kids. Get out. Let her go and eat her behind. Go. She's done with you. She's done. She's through with you. Let's come back. Get out. This will last forever. Babe. Out, 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 now! So I want to see you back. Turn around. Go! No, 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 I thought this love will never wane, but now I know I can't believe that once again I'm crying. I thought I'm in love, hey, but now I'm crying. That's why I never wanna Cause love have dealt with me. So I don't want to fall. I just want to live my life. Hey, please don't be like this. Ali, just give me a chance to explain to you. Please. Let's go somewhere. Let's talk, please. 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 I do not want to talk to you, Derek. You had your chance and you blew it. Out of my way. Baby, 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 please just give me another please. chance. I can't believe that. Once again I'm crying Get out I thought I'm in love But now I'm crying Imagine my life without you That's why I never wanna Cause love have dealt with me So I don't want to fall I just want to live my life I don't want to fall in love again don't wanna fall in love I thought I found love in you And I'm feeling myself That I'm in love I thought this would last forever But I am so wrong Cause you just blame me I thought this will last forever But I am so wrong Cause you just playing games Hey I know you don't want to see me Neither do you want to talk to me which Which explains why you blocked my line Please, V, I need to talk to you. Derek, didn't I say to you that I don't want to see you? But you need to hear me out. Please, I, I am not going to take much of your time. Please, 30 minutes. Or even 10 minutes is fine. Please, I need to talk to you, V. I thought this would last forever. Well, let me hear it, Derek. Let me hear the lies and excuses you have come up with to defend the lies you told all through our relationship. Let me hear it. Um, firstly, I am going to apologize. I'm truly sorry for everything. Believe me, this wasn't how I wanted you to find out. Oh, it wasn't? I was going to tell you, V. You were? When? You had two whole years and four months to have told me that you are married. You didn't think to tell me that I was dating a married man. I'm sorry. I mean, I'm truly sorry. Mm. But I am not a married man. You expect me to believe that? The woman in question showed a photo of you and two children. Your children. Did she make that up too? Not entirely. 
Mm. But a part of being married. <sighs> okay. Lauren and I dated for seven years. It was an on and off relationship. We didn't know what we were doing. But better still, she didn't know. You see, Lauren is a very difficult woman to deal with. Our first breakup happened three years into our relationship. When she took in with our first child. We didn't want pregnancy. I wasn't making enough money at the time, so I, I suggested an abortion, which she didn't accept. After so much fights and arguments, she said she was going to have the baby with or without my help. So she broke up and we moved on with her life. I was searching for greener pasture. So I kept on pushing, but nothing was forthcoming. After so many failed attempts, I decided to go look for Lauren. I went in search of her and I found her with the baby. Our son was three months old at the time. I felt so bad. I didn't like the situation I saw her in. I mean, no woman deserves to be in that condition. Not even a lady who had just given me my first child. So I said I was going to do something to change her situation and that of the child. I vowed I was going to be in the child's life. I vowed I was going to make things better for her and that my son. I vowed to be in my son's life. So I did everything possible to make it work. We got back together. And then she she helped me with the job I am doing now, which she got through the connections of her father. But then things started to change about her. I started to witness different behaviors and different characters of her. So much that I could barely tolerate. But because I loved her, I stayed back. After some time, she... She told me she was pregnant again. Because things were already going for and I, I decided it was wise that we take our relationship to another level. So I proposed and she accepted. But she still wasn't happy. She wanted more. She wanted more out of life. She started to make demands. Demands that I could barely afford. She had friends who were married to richer guys. So she would always compare me to their husbands. She wanted me to be like their husbands. For our wedding, she decided it was going to be a destination wedding. It was just too much. It was just too much. She said she couldn't continue to live a life of uncertainty with me. There was, was no other day but the day she gave birth to her second child. She moved out and moved on with, moved in with her friend leaving the newborn baby with her mother. I couldn't trust anybody with the children, so I went to her mother to take the children, and then I called my mother to come and help out with the children. After some time, Lauren came back, bitter, and threatening to arrest me for kidnapping our children. We were able to sort out things, she started visiting again. 
After some time, her, her visitation turned into sleep overnight. And then we became intimate again. <sighs> Two years later, she left and moved on with another guy. No text, no calls, nothing. But I was sure she was fine because I, I followed her on IG. And that was when you came into my life. Listen, boy. There was something about you that attracted me to you. Something about you wanted me to come really close to you. Something about you wanted me to be in touch with you. For I have never loved any woman the way I love you. I was scared to tell you about my kids. I thought if I, if I told you, she would leave me just the way Lauren did. And then I'll be left broken. Believe me, V. It is you I want to spend the rest of my life with. Not Lauren. Not anyone else. But you. Linda. Hey, my heart is blended. I search for love, it's nowhere to be found. Hey, they told me that love is purified. But why is mine so ugly? Are you fucking serious, V? You're back with him? Girl, are you out of your mind? I'm in love, divine. With a married man for crying out loud. Listen, he's not married. He was formally engaged to her, but not anymore. Listen, he has explained everything to me and frankly speaking, I really should have listened to his side of the story before jumping into conclusions. Fine, maybe you should have. But it doesn't change anything. He's a dad. And I told him, <sighs> it's not every guy that will own up to his responsibilities and live by it. Derek is that guy. He told me he's no longer with his ex and I believe him. Soon, we'll be visiting his children. <laughs> you don't know what you're doing. You don't know what you're doing. I love him. I love him so very much you have no idea. He makes me happy. Oh, I love, I absolutely love who I am whenever I'm around him. <laughs> you know what? Let me love this Ugh. guy. V. He's not out of the woods, Venus. There's one thing being done with someone and another cutting off that person completely from your life. Hmm? Well, from where I stand, Derek is the it guy for me. V. I hope to God you know what you're doing. Oh, I do know. I really do hope you know what you're doing. Hey, my heart is blended. I search for love, it's nowhere to be found. Um, I think we need to put an end to this relationship. Yeah, that's, that's what's best for us. I'm getting back together with Lauren. Her parents and my parents, they... They are trying to get us back together. Your parents? What then is your take on it? I mean, 
What do you have to say for yourself? Um, wait, mom. wait, you have made a decision. Isn't that why you're here? Um, my mom, she thinks it's better I get married to Lauren and then, I mean, 